everybody. Hello, how are you? Hope all is well. Daniel from Daniel Elohim's. And I wanted to make this video uh, coming to you from my workshop again. I apologize for not having posted any videos in a while. I uh, have chronic back pain and it's been acting up quite a bit lately. Probably in store for another surgery. My third on my back. I have pins and rods in there right now. And uh, so I'm in constant pain from that. But I also have another bulging disc, pressing on the nerve bundle, increasing my sciatic pain. There's that. Um, I'm sure most of you saw the video from Marfugal and talking about the um, trumpet sounds that a lot of people are hearing around the world. I personally experienced myself and told on a, I called in one night to Marfugal and uh, told him about my experience, which was I was asleep. I always sleep with my bedroom window open and my head is right under the window. And I heard a trumpet sound and I thought I was dreaming. Uh, opened my eyes, continued to hear the sound of trumpets and sat up and opened my window all the way and heard trumpet sounds and didn't know what they were. Um, right away, I kind of assumed I was still dreaming. And when I was fully awake and aware and the sounds kept coming, um, right away, my mind went to Revelation and the trumpets and uh, so that's what I thought they were and they could very well be that and uh, but they could also but what's causing them um, is it you know are they angels are they the angelic beings in Revelation that are playing the trumpets or could God be using something else to cause the trumpet sounds and I kind of think that what may be causing those sounds are, or is the pull shift that is occurring right now. I've done a little bit of research on it, and I'll put the links uh, in the video, uh, wherever they go. But anyway, um, it could be the pull shifts which are occurring right now. Science is actually proving that these pull shifts are happening. And they're happening at an increased rate. The rate that they're happening, they were saying that it was, uh, I think, I'm going to go off the cuff here, 10% um, every 100 years. Then they've moved that to 10% pull shift every decade. And that is also increasing. And I'll put some links into some videos that I've found, um, some uh, YouTubers that I watch. Um, Dabu777, I think his name is, um, uh, I forget the name of the other one, Observers, something Observers, but they do uh, scientific research um, on things about the earth, the sun, and things that affect the earth. So I'll put those links here in the video for you guys to go check those out. These could be pull shifts that are causing these trumpet sounds over the last few years. Uh, my experience was two years ago, approximately. And uh, as you, if you saw the video from Marfugal um, yesterday, I believe it was, I just watched it this morning. Um, he has videos from uh, somewhere in the Middle East there. I uh, forget where it's at. And uh, he shows those there. And uh, they were uh, pretty, pretty intriguing to see, but it it could be these pole shifts that are causing these sounds. Something that we're not used to hearing. Um, the pole shift is happening very fast now. Um, we are very close to uh, bad days, as one of the YouTubers put it, where. Who knows what's going to happen because we haven't experienced it in this degree this fast. Uh, before so hey, I appreciate you guys 
I love you. You're all my brothers and sisters in Christ, our Lord, Savior. Um, I want to make a video about the Our Father prayer. This is intriguing because Our Father who art in heaven, you know the prayer. If you don't, it's in Matthew. I forget where, if Matthew 4 or 5, something like that. Matthew 9, I believe. Anyway, he says this prayer. Um, Jesus says this prayer. Yeshua, our Savior Christ, Hamashiach, the um, anointed one. He, uh, but there's uh, two books that it's in. Um, Matthew and I think Luke. So there's two different accounts of this prayer. Now the prayer itself seems pretty straightforward, but leading up to the prayer, the verses before, the chapters before, one chapter says um, he's in one place doing something, and then in Luke, he's it's it's a whole different setup. He's doing something else before the prayer. Um, is this a real prayer? I know the Pope has uh, tried to or the Pope said he wanted to change the prayer. Um, so there's a lot going on there. I'm still praying about that one. But again, I love you. Thank you for watching. God bless you. Um, remember to pray every day and put on the armor of God. Ephesians uh, 6.10. And, you know, literally do it. Put on the helmet, the chest plate, do it all. Even if you're standing there, by yourself you think you're looking silly but you're by yourself so pray it and put it on put on the helmet put on the breastplate gird your loins do all that stuff okay and uh i love you all thanks